Welcome back to the Strategic Sales Funnel Method course. This is module number three, Map the Customer Journey. We've discussed what our value ladder is for a local small business. We've discussed how to do, how to develop a better understanding of our target customer, of our target audience for our local small business. Now it's time to talk about how we can map out the customer journey for our local small business. Now, what is a customer journey? It's another word for what we will be constructing at the end of the day, which is a sales funnel. But what it represents, it, it, is a, a, it helps us visualize how our potential customers are going to react with our business from the first touch point to the final purchase. And what this does is it, it ensures that each stage of the sales funnel aligns with the potential customer's mindset and needs. So when it comes to mindsets and needs, when we go back to the previous module, which is where we went to go understand, you know, our target audience, like that's why reading the, the Google reviews is important because again, you, it's like you get a, to take a step inside of your customer's mindset to, uh, and what their needs are from their point of view, from their perspective, you know, you don't have to guess, you don't have to figure it out. So, you know, as we are on this journey to take the guesswork out of clarifying a clear and well-crafted marketing message, I mean, a marketing strategy for your sales funnel and all your other marketing efforts. Like I said, the first step here is we got to, well, the first step, obviously getting a, a gist of what our, our, our value ladder is, but the, the three steps specifically is first, we got to understand our target, our target audience. Then we got to map out the customer journey. And then in the module number four, which is what we'll talk about is we got to get clear on what our goals and metrics are going to be. So again, uh, in this module, we will cover again what the basic, what a what a basic sales funnel looks like, what a basic customer journey looks like. So again, I'm not the expert here. There's plenty of other experts out here that can help you develop more understanding uh, of what the customer journey is online. Uh, you can go and just Google uh, customer journey and uh, you'll find a lot of great resources, a lot of tools, templates. But again, uh, my goal here is just to help you get started as soon as possible. And so we go just stick to the basics. We go stick to the most simplest fundamental aspects uh, of uh, crafting this marketing strategy so that you can hit the ground running. All right, so let's go ahead and dive into module number three.